Well, it is a concept that's been floating around Madison for decades and could be closer to reality. Tahalia Mohadeen spoke with city leaders about plans for a pedestrian mall on State Street, and she joins us there live with the details. I'm told by as early as this summer, everything you see around me could be dramatically different. But first, city leaders need to work through a lot of logistics. Those pushing for a pedestrian and bicycle mall on the 400 to 600 blocks of State Street are taking note of the success the city has had in the past in the 60s and 70s to make changes to traffic flow on the tail end of the street. They say though a reimagined State Street comes with challenges, the possibilities are plenty. The potential gain is big. And what we're looking to is to attract and to draw more people to come. The residents of Madison, tourists, the office workers and the residents, we need to create things that people are interested in seeing and places that are alive and vibrant. The pedestrian mall is still in its very early stages as there are a lot of constraints for city planners to work through. They have to make sure the changes are accessible for people of all abilities and that the new vision considers emergency access, city maintenance work, and business deliveries. Now in about a half hour, the group behind the research needed to make this a reality is set to present its findings and potential next steps to city leaders. Reporting live on State Street, Hadeen, News 3 Now.